I get to introduce you to this gentleman. Why, hello, sir. Expert of all experts. Well, thank you. Friend of all friends. Well, thank you, thank you very, very uh, much. This is Oscar Duvall. He brings to us some of our top end electronics. All of us are now into electronic devices. So many people have their cell phones. Very true. People have tablets. A whole true. bunch of people have computers. True. And the fact of the matter is, these devices keep us from interacting. How many of you have photos on your phone that you can't share with anyone unless you're standing right next to them and showing them your phone? Right. Well, this, think about them. Lots have all these great photos. Oh, I just put that one in backwards. That's okay. Uh, but the nice thing about this is, let's say if you have photos, if you have documents, if you have spreadsheets, anything that you want, like the receipts, you can now scan directly from your scanner and put it directly out to your computer. In a matter of seconds. This now takes all those, quote, personal electronics. It really does make them personal. You know, in the old days where you had one photograph and you get them in the little envelopes with a whole bunch of other photographs and you get it at the drugstore, right. you had one keeper of the photo. It's somebody who was the guardian of the cardboard box and those photos were never shared. So now you can share all these photos without your friends and family and it's actually very simple to do. Because it's now an electronic file that it's, can be emailed and sent, et cetera, right. et cetera. So you can actually hook this out to your PC, or you don't even need a PC. That's the nice thing about this. You don't need any special software, you don't need a computer, but this is what you do. You grab your photos, right. and you feed it right through the scanner itself, and it goes right through it. And as it's going through the scanner, that's if, all the time it took for that's a photograph. All the, so and we, it is already on your computer. So we just scan that photo, and it popped up directly right onto the computer. So in if full you have, color. If you have, uh, now, in full color, if you want to do it in black and white, you can do it in black and white. Can, and I apologize for getting really excited. I didn't mean to interrupt, but can I, can I throw something else out there? Okay. There's Your... two different types of scanners out there in the world. There are what are called flatbed scanners and wand scanners. Flatbeds are like your copy machine where you have to lay it on top. Wand scanners are handheld and you can move them across something. This, this is both. It's both. Today's the first day that it's been on the air all year. We are now down to just what? Three colors, right? Three colors. We have purple, okay. we have blue. So we've got colors that have sold out. Anything that you want to print, copy, store, share, you can now do. And it's done quickly. Now, by the way, what you don't realize is, is that it's just one simple wire that goes here, but I don't even have to hook it up. I can just take this unit to mom's house. Right. and She's then, the keeper of the cardboard box of photos. Well, here's the thing. You don't even need a computer. So let's say if you have just a scanner itself. So we have our scanner right here. And now we don't have this hooked up to anything. But it's got the sheet feeder built in. Right. But it's also got a LCD screen right in the front. So all I do is this. And a little memory card, which is four gigs, which is going to be a couple thousand photographs that I can store just on this unit before I even transfer them to the computer. So watch what I'm doing. I'm actually scanning the photos, and the photo will actually pop oh. up right on the screen. In color. So oh, and I just touched it. I'm sorry. That's okay. But it was there. <laughs> and if, let's say if I'm doing uh, receipts, if I'm doing recipes, all I do is I feed it right through. Now, as you do this, I'm going to tip it so that our camera can get that. There you go. So right now there I'm scanning go. in my special recipes, and it's going to pop up directly right on the screen. There it is. And it's telling that you got it correctly. So all you do now is that saves it directly to that little memory card that's in of this. Now I can share it with my friends and family very simply and I don't need a computer to do this. All right, this gets even better. Let's say you've got photo albums. Do you remember? You may not. Well, you're, I've, you'll remember. Photo okay. albums that they had the little sticky corners that would hold the photographs in place. Do you remember those? Some of them had plastic that went over the top and you don't dare peel that back. You might damage your photograph. So what do you do? This scanner comes out. Well, it just pops right out. Comes so out of its cradle. You press out the button. Of its base. Now watch this. Oh. What we're going to do is can I, can I pick this we'll up? Go pick it up. Now, yeah. uh, it's actually a very delicate photo. We we have we didn't take it out of the glass because it's actually sticking to the this glass. This is your wife's. Is a grandfather. Or great That's grandfather? her grandfather. Uh, was in World War II and hated pineapple. Like it looks like Charles. <laughs> he's a, a he nice looks like handsome a bad man. Dude, right now there. watch this. I want to scan this photo. This is all I do. I wouldn't. I wouldn't take it out of the glass. I press. That would scare me. Now he's doing this right through the glass in the frame. All I'm doing is just pressing the button that says scan, and I'm just moving down the photo itself. Now after I get everything that I want from the photo, right. is I press scan again. And right when I do that, there the is. photo pops up directly right on the screen. Now here's the nice thing about so this. So this is a one of a kind photograph. Right. So I don't have to take it. could never be shared with 
the other grandchildren, well, and it, mom if, and dad. Right, because sometimes older photos stick to that, the, that acid paper, yes. and you can actually ruin the photos. So now the photos will pop up directly right on the screen. Now, instead of using special software, this is what where the photos are all stored. They're stored on right there. that little memory card. Now, I can put this in my, into my computer if I want to. I can share it with my friends and family. But I can use this, take this to the library and scan books, documents. I can scan anything that, let's say, if it's in a frame. Let's say there's going to be times that you want to scan something that's in a book. And, well, instead of ripping out the pages or been, buying one of the expensive flatbed scanners. Yeah, they scanners, really they get angry when you tear the pages Yeah, out. they get a little upset. So, <laughs> so this is all you do. Let's say you have your book. Right. You put it right down. And all you do is you press the scan button. And as, as I press that scan button, I bring it all the way through, just like this, and then I press the scan button again. So that book was now copied right onto the scanner itself. I, I find this technology to be just fascinating. It, it's really cool. And now, it's easy. Then all you do is when you connect it again, everything goes into your, goes your, into your computer, computer, and it becomes what's called a PDF file, which, again, can be mailed, can be shared, right. can be printed. So whether it's recipes, photographs, tax documents, it's it's the information that is truly our life, and it's pretty. You just scan that photo, and we two just scan the photo. So that photo just went right into the computer. So I'm going to do the next one. Now it even comes with OCR software. So what that does what is, is OCR. So if you have a document and you scan that in, it, it will scan into the computer, and you can actually edit it if you want to. So well, if your kids, oh. so if your kids are doing homework, if you're doing That's things for, for taxes, cool. very simply, this is all you do. You just feed it directly right into the scanner. Everything po pops up directly right into your computer. Now, by the way, when you buy it from QVC, all these colors that we have available were not available in the marketplace. GPX did it for us. And we've got three colors that are still available. We've got uh, the purple, is it the blue and the black? We got the purple. Okay, and all we three the colors blue have and been the black. very popular. Uh, you, we get the, the batteries, we give those to you as well, which the batteries are automatically. rechargeable batteries. And this is the way to scan. By the way, it's still winter. We've got, what, 57 days, I think, till spring. It's still the perfect time of year to pull out that cardboard box of old photographs, scan them so that you can share them and email them. Uh, my father just celebrated his 90th birthday. Oh, wow, congratulations. And he is the keeper of the photographs. So he has everything. And he won't part with a single one. And I bet he has photos that you probably haven't seen oh. in years. I, there, he's got photos he didn't want us to see So <laughs> when he was younger. <laughs> so this is what you do. You get those photos, and you tell him, Dad, I'm just going to bring this over. Yep. And you scan everything in. And then all those great memories, well, like my, that's my little this, niece and uh, my is, little that nephew. Is one of my favorite photographs of Oscar right there. Thank you, buddy. Oh, That's anytime. very, very cool. At a price of $55, and now with Easy Pay, four payments of $13.75, it's one of the most affordable ways to share those memories. Today, it's the only day for the entire month, and it's early in the month, to operate on what we call Easy Pay, four Easy Pay payments. Coming up a little bit later on, this is a mid-weight Rowenta iron 